Yes, I'm paying my dues. They gon' try to intrude. Cause you the multitude. They be quick to accuse. When you got different views, just know you gon' pay the price. Press up an item you choose. Many times in the culture, hit you with them cat ultra. I knew you was a vulture. Holy Ghost, get the ushers. No, 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 I can't touch it. Shock you, then now you flister. Crashing down, I was cluttered. Doing sort of. Falling out through the rubble. Remember, this is jungle. The top always gonna get something. The middle gotta stay hunting. Why don't rush up for nothing? 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 Agitated illusion. Only big for confusion. The institution, modern day execution. Think I need the solution. Maybe that shit I do. I'll just put it in the music. Just put it in the music. Someone put me out cause I'm on fire. I can't give it to you about what they say. They've been searching for that thing to get them higher. You can't catch my joke, can't catch my way. That's what paying my dues. They gon' try to intrude. Cause you the multitude. They be quick to accuse. When you got different views, just know you gon' pay the price. Press up the item you choose. Many times in the culture, hit you with them cat ultra. I knew you was a vulture. Holy Ghost, get the ushers. No, 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 I can't touch it. Shock you, then now you flister. Crashing down, I was cluttered. Doing sort of. Falling out through the rubble. Remember, this is jungle. The top always gon' get something. The middle gotta stay hunting. Why don't rush up for nothing? 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 Agitated illusion. Only big for confusion. The institution, modern day execution. Think I need a solution, maybe that's what I do I'll Just put it in the music, just put it in the music Someone put me out cause I'm on fire I can't give it to you about what they say They've been searching for that thing to get them higher You can't catch my joke, can't catch my way That's what paying my dues. They gon' try to intrude. Cause you the multitude. They be quick to accuse. When you got different views, just know you gon' pay the price. Press up the item you choose. Many times in the culture, hit you with them cat ultra. I knew you was a vulture. Holy Ghost, get the ushers. No, 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 I can't touch it. Shock you, then now you flister. Crashing down, I was cluttered. Doing sort of. Falling out through the rubble. Remember, this is jungle. The top always gonna get something. The middle gotta stay hunting. Why don't rush up for nothing? 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 Agitated illusion. Only big for confusion. The institution, modern day execution. I got the solution, maybe that's what I do I'll just put it in the music, just put it in the music Someone put me out cause I'm on fire I can't give it to you about what they say They've been searching for that thing to get them higher You can't catch my joke, can't catch my way That's what paying my dues. They gon' try to intrude. Cause you the multitude. They be quick to accuse. When you got different views, just know you gon' pay the price. Press up the item you choose. Many times in the culture, hit you with them cat ultra. I knew you was a vulture. Holy Ghost, get the ushers. No, 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 I can't touch it. Shock you, then now you flister. Crashing down, I was cluttered. Doing sort of. Falling out through the rubble. Remember, this is jungle. The top always gonna get something. The middle gotta stay hunting. Why don't rush up for nothing? 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 Agitated illusion. Only big for confusion. The institution, modern day execution. Think I need the solution, maybe that's what I do I'll just put it in the music, just put it in the music Someone put me out cause I'm on fire I can't give it to you about what they say They've been searching for that thing to get them higher You can't catch my joke, can't catch my way That's what paying my dues. They gon' try to intrude. Cause you the multitude. They be quick to accuse. When you got different views, just know you gon' pay the price. Press up the item you choose. Many times in the culture, hit you with them cat ultra. I knew you was a vulture. Holy Ghost, get the ushers. No, 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 I can't touch it. Shock you, then now you flister. Crashing down, I was cluttered. Doing sort of. Falling out through the rubble. Remember, this is jungle. The top always gonna get something. The middle gotta stay hunting. Why don't rush up for nothing? 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 Agitated illusion. Only big for confusion. The institution, modern day execution. Think I the solution, maybe that's what I do I'll just put it in the music, just put it in the music Someone put me out cause I'm on fire I can't give it to you about what they say They've been searching for that thing to get them higher You can't catch my joke, can't catch my way That's what paying my dues. They gon' try to intrude. Cause you the multitude. They be quick to accuse. When you got different views, just know you.
know you gon' pay the price. Press up the item, you choose. Let's tie in the culture. Hit you with them cat ultra. I knew you was a vulture. Holy Ghost, get the usher. No, 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 I can't push up. Shock you, then now you flustered. Crashing down, I was cluttered. Boom, slaughter. Falling out through the rubble. You rub my niggas and jump at the top. I was gonna get something. The middle gotta stay hunting. Why don't rush up for nothing? 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 Agitated illusion. Only bitch for confusion. The institution. Modern the execution. Think I need the solution. Maybe that shit I do. Well, just put it in the music. Just put it in the music. Someone put me out cause I'm on fire I can't give a shit about what they say They been searching for that thing to get them higher You can't catch my drip, can't catch my wave you how the pill jury team franchise
up. Play my cards, dump my hand, ain't really no time for luck. Either you got it, you don't. Lie to yourself if you want. I put my team on my back. Did what I could, what I had. Now I'll be all in my bag. Copy and paste with the swag. Bet you can't do it like me. All my winners on repeat. Take your L like a boss. Dancing toes on your feet. I can never take a loss. I ain't set up for defeat. Four Giados on the truck. I had a dream in the stuff. <laughs> Living my life cause we up, looking bad like where the love That's why I be hella low key, but contrary to belief Loyalty runs deep, I keep my into the streets Struggle turn me to a beast I'm off the chain, I'm off the leash, but baby girl I play for keeps Told my brother lately I've been scheming Against our eyes like Willie Beeman I've been grinding lately, this my season Lord knows I'm trying to find my reason Lay it out on the line, ain't no looking back Giving my all with no she's attached Can't roll no bottom, roll through the cracks Spotlight on you, but how you gon' act? Hey, I remember sleeping with my ribs touched I remember sleeping with my ribs touched Now I get in the go 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 Ain't it crazy how them tables turn? You can fold or you can stand firm I'm a real one, so I ain't concerned. I'm fully built for this life. I think I earn all my stripes. I don't believe all the hype. Get back on my feet and get right. Watch you work, watch him hate, watch him lurk, can't relate. Watch you skirt out the mud, out the dirt, above the waters, in the murks, at the gate, on sight. Red breed, red tight, set the bar, take flight. Yo, yeah. I've been grinding since I'm young and they told me my timing was coming. I've been hustling with no fun and forget all the fame, get the money. I'm out in LA where it's sunny. I've been eating since I'm young and since we ain't have food in our tummy. The life we was living ain't funny, but you cannot take nothing from me. Put that on my mama, my daughter, my cousin, my brother, I'll show you. Way better than I can tell you. The type of dreams that they say. That's why I learn from my face. Don't do the handouts or the favors. Told my brother I'ma get this paper. Was left behind, I'll see it later. To keep it real, you don't need to wait up. Lay it all on the line, ain't no looking back. Giving my all with no strings attached. Came from the bottom, roll through the cracks. Spotlight on you, but how you gonna act? Hey, I remember sleeping with my ribs touched. I remember sleeping with my ribs touched. Now I get it go. Let me feel myself a little bit. 
little bit, little bit. You ain't talking big. Get out my way, little bit.
stripes, said it's alright. Then I cut her off, shorty stepped on my off whites. Okay, now wait, wait, wait. Gotta get the bag in racks every day. Don't tell me to relax, I can't, I'm saying. Got a new press, those in the J's in a way. Got a new press, watch where they don't take time. My dog on the hop, it's too high. And he wanna play ball, hit a three point shot. With this my court, got a block on line. Uh, I made about a million, and I'm only 19. On the icy, water dripping on the white tee. And yeah, shorty got a man, but she's saying, wife me. I got chess coming in like a pair of Nike. If I like it, then you know I'm finna get it. a lot for the wins came in a drop on the 10 got me on top top once again yeah 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 i had to tighten the plan yeah i got a break in the end now we on top top once again i don't want it if it ain't love if it ain't get it away from me who you gonna jack if it ain't us lab be to the bakery some mad that i came up i know my granny gonna pray for me it was just us in the vacancy we had to get it from a to b wheels never felt like this two seats in the hills how i feel righteous blue sheets for the mills but the deal priceless new keys can't care what's built private i might just double it up did it mm. never enough i'm with it uh. five two three on the business whole team got wins in the world suspended i told them what i told them we did a lot for the wins came in a drop on the 10 now we on top top once again yeah hey I had to tighten the plan. I got it right in the end. Now we on top. Got a spot and it's locked to the click all in. 
I got ops, if he drop, I just hit my dance. I was top, they just watched, had to take my wins. They wouldn't let me in. I've been on 10, 10 cents. Who really holding it down? I've been holding it down. football now from sunny North Carolina and off we go from uptown Charlotte and that one will bounce out of the back of the end zone so we will start here at the 25 from scrimmage it's second down nice play right there to stop him behind the line but i want to say this defense continues to play him here in the first half yeah we know you know better than i he has the ability to take over a game so what do you do yeah i think you have to make sure that you bottle him in at varying levels because if you crowd everyone to the line of scrimmage if he breaks through it's nothing but room to run and this one incomplete too much contact to hold on to that one, and it's third down. Nice play there to force the incompletion, and to me, one thing's for sure. When you're the underdogs and you're playing on the road, you absolutely have to get takeaways. You've got to get the ball from them. Yeah, win that turnover battle, going to be key. They didn't get one there, but you get the feeling they keep making plays like that, so they might just get a few. Yeah, once you get one, defensive teams think they come in bunches. Boy, a nice play there as they wind up converting. That was a nice play. Third and 15. They'll run on first down. Thorpe. He'll be taken down at the 48 for a pickup of two yards. Well, any lane that might have been open there was closed pretty quickly, and that was because the defensive front, they won that battle at the point of attack at the line of scrimmage. They used great leverage, held their spot, and stacked him up. The throw over the middle, taken in. And this will move the chains again as the tackle's going to be made at the 49ers' 38-yard line. So on the other side of the field now, it's first and 10 as they've got things rolling on this drive. Now a give, right side. Thorpe, a loss of a full three yards, and now it's second down. That was well played there defensively. Two tight ends in the formation, which essentially gave them seven blockers up front. Hard to imagine with all that size and beef that they could let a tackler through. But that's exactly what happened. A loss resulted. And he fires one that's intercepted. Picked off at the 33. And the return stops at the 39-yard line. They brought the house that time on the young rookie, maybe a little rattled through the pick. And you have to be prepared for a lot of pressure as a rookie quarterback because most defensive coordinators are going to test you that way. So when you see that, the ball's got to get out of your hands quickly, and that means your receivers have to understand they have to break up their routes quickly as well. And he was hit as he threw it there, and it forces it incomplete. So line of scrimmage still at 39 on second and 10. On play action, they'll throw. And his throw is going to be incomplete. They have to like what they've done defensively here at the outset of this drive. They forced a couple of incomplete passes, bring up a third and ten. Don't be surprised to bring a little pressure on this snap. Sliding out of the pocket. And that is incomplete. That was an interesting look there because as soon as he got outside the pocket, I thought he was going to take off and run for yardage. But what often happens now with these quarterbacks who can move, defenses want to try and keep bodies in front of them. And I think that discouraged him from taking off and made him try a pass downfield that fell incomplete. Got a man and he hits him in stride. And now this is going to be close. The defense says they stopped him, and they did. Well, that, my friend, I guess is the definition of a head scratcher. Fourth and long, this stage of the game, what were they doing? I just have to believe that he, he looked at the situation, still in the first half, 
decide if there's a time to be aggressive. Now is it because there's still time to make up for it if things don't go right. Of course, a lot of questions on this one. And look, I want to go for it as much as anyone. But fourth and long? Yeah, I don't think I would have there. That one seemed a little bit on the irrational side. Fans might be a little angry at that one. It'll go down as a two-yard loss, and it brings up a third down. A loss of two. Brings up third down and six. Operating from the gun. Fields. Got a man. It's Patterson complete. And he will have the Bears first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. A gain there of 12 yards and a first down for the Bears. First and 10 at the 32-yard line. From the gun. Fields. And he'll complete this one to Patterson. And he is in. Touchdown. That's some bullshit, dude. Cordero Patterson, 32 yards, and the Bears have taken the early lead. Everybody likes to see the long ball thrown, but when you throw it underneath and you see someone catch the ball, secure it, make their moves, and then turn it into bigger plays, that's a lot of fun to watch as well. And here's Shane Graham now to kick it away following the touchdown. And no return on this one as the fair catch is signaled for and taken. The Niners take over first and 10 at their own 25-yard line. The 49er offense set to get this drive underway. On first down, George. And he will lose yardage here back at the 23-yard line. Two yeah. yards the lead, second and 12. Because this size, he's this a tough bitch man right to bring here. down, but they do a nice job there stopping his progress and not allowing him to get back to the line of scrimmage. First play of the drive goes the wrong way. Here's second and 12. Rolling to his right. And that's going to wind up incomplete. However, we do have a flag down. Let's check in with our referee. So they saw the contact before the ball arrived. Penalty flag for pass interference. And trying to avoid pass interference is so difficult. You're trying to slow down these skilled receivers, and somehow, some way, they make plays on the football, and sometimes you're there. And now the ball's out. Fumble near midfield. And this is picked up by the Bears. And they'll set up shop right near midfield at the 49-yard line. Uh -huh. See what I'm saying? This shit's bulls. He's used to running the football a lot. In that time, he was loose with it, had it knocked free. He always has to think to himself that there's always going to be traffic around because of what you just said. Not that elusive. Not going to get into the open field very often. Remember, he's not Lamar Jackson, not Michael Vick back in the day. Always has to protect the football because there's always going to be people around. First and 10 at the 22 yard line. They'll run on first down. This will be stopped about two yards shy of the marker. Eight-yard gain, second and two. At the 14-yard line. It's a gain of eight. Brings up Yo, this is why I don't like, winning this, like playing this game because of this shit right here. After one, seven, nothing. On EA Sports. Bears seven. 49ers nothing. Second down now. Thorpe. And he is in. Touchdown, Chicago. 14 yards. And the Bears will add on to their lead. A solid blocking up front from the guys on the offensive line allowed him to get in for the touchdown. Yeah, some might say that the guys on the offensive line were in concert. I used to have a coach who called it marrying up, meaning when you get on a guy, you just stay right there. Each guy has his own assignment. That allowed the runner to make the big move towards the end zone. Fair catch made at the 25-yard line. The Niners take over first and 10 at their own 25-yard line. The 49er offense set to get this drive underway. And they had the fumble last time that led to a touchdown. That's a no-no. We'll see what they do here this go-around. And he will not make it back to the line of scrimmage as he's going to be taken down. Well, someone's been up to the task so far in this game. They are already up a couple of scores, Brandon, and guess what? I think they're just going to pin their ears back now and get up field and get after the quarterback. It's been such an impressive first half to get that lead. He goes full extension, and he's got it. The 49ers now going to use the first of their timeouts. They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this second quarter. 
He'll buy some time right. And I think the ball's out, but this will fortunately wind up out of bounds. And CD, that's the second time this half they put it on the carpet. Now, the first one they lost. Good news here, it doesn't cost them. They do say that things even out in the course of a ball game. So you mentioned they lost the first one. This time, able to retain possession, but they can't get into this habit. The ball can't continue to go on the ground. Rolling to his left. This dude quit. I guess you can mark that down as a win. Are you irresponsible without your money or not? Thought he had a plan, but we can foil his block. Heard him sneaking in, so we just ran in the spot. And now we spin the block around just like the hell on the clock. He quit. Why the fuck did he quit? Thought he had a plan, but we can foil his block. Sneaking in, so we just ran in the spot, and then we spin the block around just like the hands on the clock. Come like the bat of the hell, I dare you to cross like a revenant. My energy paralyzed, I'm like a finger of 11. Take a second, I'm finna send it like a pair in a mess. To the best, if it ain't me, then you need to a confession. You a mess. Oh, uh, you were scary to me. I heard you was the leader, but that ain't a pair to me. Put dust on you like Cheetah, run up there, I'm airing the scene. I feel just like the Cheetah Prince, and I'm an heir to the seat. I mean, for real. Test the driver's soft, so I don't need A dude quit. He quit because <laughs> I don't know why he quit. He's winning, so set to go now on a beautiful sunny afternoon. I'm just trying to get better go, players now. Even if you even if you lose the game, you get better players. I just earned a 95 overall player just by losing. I don't care. Ball up to the 35 now as they come up on first and 10. Now the first carry for Dalvin Cook. And his defense not giving him anything there. Maybe a yard up to the 36. The tackle made by the no doubt about Play your little really nice job there by the defense not allowing him to get to the perimeter. But that means your defensive ends, your outside linebackers, the guys that you play. And down he goes. The 49ers get there. And they weren't in zone coverage, they were in man, and each man did his job. And that looked like vintage, old-school coverage, didn't it? Man coverage reminded me of an old Raiders team. They had a Hall of Famer at one corner and a Defensive Player of the Year at the other, and they just locked people down. Three and out, a real danger here on their opening drive as they come up on a third and 12. Vic to throw it. Setting up the screen for Cook. And he'll only get this to about the 35. Well short of the line to gain. Only two yards and it'll be a punt on their opening possession. Uh, here goes Vic on fourth down, and he can't get rid of it. He's taken down. A surprising move here on the opening drive of the game, and the Niners take over in terrific field position. They're coming out with a jumbo package to start the drive. the play fake he'll look to throw and the throw left sideline here is caught but they'll rule it incomplete couldn't keep his feet in second down i think we can all understand what they're thinking right now they take over the ball and field goal range after the turnover so they've got that in their hip pocket but they've got to go for the end zone and turn this into a bigger point their thinking is a touchdown is really what they should get from starting here getting three points at the end of this drive that would feel disappointing. And that'll be incomplete. Took a pretty good shot as he tried to pull that one in. 
Couldn't hang on third down. Well, they've got man coverage on the outside, and my scouting report on these DBs tells me that they love to take batters in their own hands. They want man coverage, not zone. And there was good coverage there that forced the incompletion. The chance of wasting this great starting field position, a real threat. This is third and long. Here's a play fake as they set up to throw. And a throw there going to be incomplete. They certainly had good starting field position on that drive, but couldn't do anything with it after three plays. I have to admit that that's a disappointing end to excellent field position. When that drive started, they had six points that they were thinking about. Out is Myers for the Seahawk field goal. This from 44 yards out, left hash. And his kick is good. Didn't hit it all that well, but he got enough on it to put it through. And the 49ers take a 3-0 lead. In the end, the opening drive, Charles does yield points. Maybe not the touchdown that they wanted, though. They have a bottom line. They wanted to get something out of that drive, and they did that. Three points, they won't turn that down. yard line a good starting spot for Washington as they come up first and 10 at their own 42 cook and he will be brought down at about the 43 that time two yards on the pickup there it'll be second and eight yeah I don't see why you're trying to run the ball getting him on the ground but I think the play gets made your run's not working because if they can't shoot field, up their job is to go ahead and get low almost get into a ball sometimes stack things up and make it difficult for the runner to find a hole and they'll get this well past midfield before being stopped just before the 35 first and 10 at the 37 yard line, line of scrimmage the 37 on first and 10 throwing Vic and the Niners get there and bring him down. Grover Stewart gets him for a loss of eight. What great push up front. After the sack on first down, Vic. And he's going to go down again. They'll wind up losing 10 on the sack. And it'll lead to a third and long. It's now third down. Third and long for Vic. Pass incomplete, but the flag in the backfield. And this might be a roughing call. So a pretty early he knew he was going to take that in RB. He's like, fuck like you. officials are going to let everyone know they're taking charge of this game. They're always going to protect the quarterback. Cook following the penalty. And a short gain there down to the 37-yard line. The tackle made by Nicholas Morrow. Well, sometimes you just have to give credit to the defense. Great job there at the point of attack holding up. They won their battles at the line of scrimmage, left him no space to try and run. A really nice job swarming to the ball carrier. On second and nine, Vic. That's caught by his tight end, Evan Ingram. And this will move the chains again as the tackle's going to be made at the 49ers 25 yard line. 12 yards there and a first down. He's going to run it. They run the count oh, with Cook. And they take him down, losing yardage back at the 27. Officially, it's a one-yard loss. That's going to bring up second and 11. Well, they sent the power set out there, and their job is to be man-on-man -man and move people so they can run the football. But that time, too many men didn't get moved in the box defensively. They end up throwing him for a loss. The throw on second down from Vic, incomplete. Intended that time for Cooper, and it's third down. But well, we always talk about how you've got to be quick when you go through your progressions, and here's another prime example. Trying to look downfield, he's standing in the pocket, but just couldn't find anyone open, could he? No, not enough time. They hit him and forced that incompletion. On third down, Vic. He's going to let it go deep for the end zone. And oh, it'll be intercepted. Picked up by the former first rounder, Trey Waynes. What a start defensively. I mean, your offense goes out, gets the touchdown, and then you get the interception. Just perfect. How about the discipline that they showed on defense? Because after the offense scored to go up 7-zip, 
you would think they might be a little extra aggressive trying to get back at them. Instead, they read their keys well. When they took the shot downfield, they were more than prepared for that one. A gain of 11 to kick off the drive, and it's a quick first down. First down 49ers. He rifles one that's intercepted. Picked up by Denzel Ward. And he is going to get this one back to the 20 yard line. Yeah, he, what did you see on that one? Rookie yeah, mistake or just yeah, good defense? It was a combo play, but the rookie quarterback, he'll take it all on his shoulders. And the frustration level is it's evident. You can part, see though. it with him. You know, if that's a veteran quarterback, he walks off like he just threw a touchdown pass because he doesn't want to show that to the defense. The young guys, they take it more to heart. It's on their sleeve a little bit. He'll learn as he goes along. You think you're going to run <clears throat> like that? Get that nice one cool. there on the first down run, and it's you really think you're Oh, get me, Dalvin Cook. And four. On the carry, it's Cook. And this time, not as successful as he'll get back to the line of scrimmage and no more. No gain on the play that time, and they'll look to convert on what'll be a third and four. Might want to give up on that running shit with Dalvin Cook. You're not getting any words, dude. With the score, Niners three. Washington, nothing. Well, they were handed great starting field position on this drive, but now they face a third and four. Cook on the toss left. And he has the first down before he's tackled at the five. Nine yards on the play there, and it sets him up first and goal. Goal at the five-yard line. They'll try to throw it here. Vic to the goal line, but it's incomplete. Well, nearly another interception there. That would have been two drives in a row with a pick. He's got to start taking care of the ball way better than what we're seeing. Interestingly, that throw was probably worse than the one he threw the interception on last drive, but fell incomplete. On second and goal, Cook waiting in the backfield all alone. Here's Michael. Boy, you're in trouble.
You know, I got a pair. I, I got enough to go on and make this happen. And I'll go back to you. What the fuck ever, dude? There's no way in hell he done that.
He's got enough to kick this. He don't kick it. He's crazy. Boy, you really are crazy, dude. Telling you, man. Why didn't you kick the ball? I'm sorry. Chances are chances, but that was just way too much. All right. Let's play this. Yeah, I don't understand why people do that, man. Good shit. I mean, that, that's good. It's a lot better. Um. I 
I mean, he's gonna, he ain't gonna win it, that's for sure. He done messed his chances up.
Leonard Floyd. The twop. There he goes, right side. And into the end zone. A pick six for the 49er D as they score the touchdown. Jason Myers for the extra point. That's the story of the game. They've been suffocating all game long on defense. They were suffocating there again in a big way. And they've done it not just by out-athleting them, which is often the case, but by being able to adjust to anything they tried to throw at them and beating them into the punch each and every time. This was a defense that was well-prepared. This will make it into the end zone. And they'll get him down right around the 25, actually the 26 officially, so a net gain of one there. 26-yard line. Out there, set and ready for this next drive, the Washington offense. Let's just be frank, they're playing for pride at this point. <laughs> that's, that's all that's left, because victory, not a chance now. And I can't wait to see how they actually go about doing it, because... There are a lot of people watching the body language of the guys on the field now, and if they call plays they want executed, they need to do that. And do oh, you might as well just, uh... Otherwise, there could be repercussions. Yeah. We'll see how they handle the waiting. And my goodness, another interception. Picked off by Super Bowl 49 hero Malcolm Butler. CD, this defense, man, at this rate, they're just having fun out there right now. And normally with this type of a lead, if you're a starter on defense, you're saying, hey, let the other guys play. But with this going on, no one wants to come out of the game. They all want their shot at picking off a pass. Clock counting down toward 40 seconds as they take the knee. So time to start going in the other direction as they come up now third and long. Four down, four down. Mike, 53. 53, Mike, Mike. Watch the curl, watch the curl, watch the curl. The defense can stop it twice more as they take a knee here. Today's final score. So the victory here for San Francisco. And I tell you what, Charles, this might be about as good as it gets. They were incredible. Yeah, offense was in fine form. The defense through the shutout at them. I think they worked in concert together. What I like about the offense was they held the ball they pretty well. Won that game. You know, time of possession, exactly Dude. what they were looking for in this one, and that helped out their defense. Didn't have to be out there the Not bad. Time. It wasn't so bad. That, he actually played pretty good, even though know, he lost. Spring in your step, and it showed up in this one. They had a ton of spring in their step. Impressive victory. Put up a hell of a fight, though. For Charles Davis and all our crew, I'm Brandon Gunn. You've been watching the NFL on EA Sports. With that, we sign off from Landover. Okay, there's two. Only seven, right? I got good news and I got bad news. Okay.
said, what's the good news? He said, the good news is you made a lot. I said, what's the bad news? The bad news is you spent more. Okay. Look, sometimes you need the faith. Sometimes you need to know you or sometimes you need to wait. Shoot like the golden boy, but in front of bait. You can't negotiate with Drake. You gon' have to pay for way. Jugging on the main stage, the main frame. Loosen up your face, baby. Sometimes I need a vacay, meditate, hydrate, protect my energy before engagement. Grew up having nothing, you're labeled impatient. Huh. But once the boss made it, you're labeled amazing. Meticulous with words, such a force of nature. Boss. I don't want to seem absurd, but that boy's a gangster. Fo focusing on me, way from Tel Aviv. Barbados with the hustle pockets, LRDs. Distinctive destinations, all I want to see. Set to go now on a beautiful sunny afternoon. And here we go. We're underway in Madden Ultimate Team. He takes this about five yards deep. They had no run back here, so oh, yeah. bring it out to the 25. Oh, yes. Oh boy, he was almost in trouble, man. Yeah, that one sailed off. <laughs> make sure you give your receiver a chance to come down in bounds because they are very gifted. They'll make the circus catches, but they make them out of bounds. That does you no good. They throw again on second down. This one's complete. He's at the 30. 10. Touchdown, Tampa Bay. Allen Robinson. 75 yards and the Bucks have taken a first quarter lead well if they didn't get the wake up call before the game they got it right now two plays already in the end zone I think of it in boxing terms because whether it's a big shot with your first one or a probing one a little bit of a jab the second one was the payoff that was the big one that landed one, two, end zone. They'll let Elliott try and run it in. And he is not going to make it. They stop him up short. And this will remain a 6 nothing ball game. 49ers nothing. I'm not stupid, dude. You may put me out like I'm stupid, but I'm not stupid. So they went for two and failed. They didn't use him on the PAT, but now he boots this one away with a 6-0 lead. And a fair catch signaled for and taken successfully. The Niners take over first and 10 at their own 25-yard line. This dude quit too? What the fuck? That's three.
Jesus well. Shit, kick that off, huh? Afternoon. And off we go in Madden Ultimate Team. Fielded in the end zone. CJ man. And he'll be brought down shy of the 20, so the decision to bring it out of the end zone, not a good one. <laughs> Forgot his last name. I mean, his last, not his last name, but his name. So from inside the 20, here's first and 10 at the 18. <laughs> On the ground, it's the first carry here for Jamal Charles. And he is met at the line of scrimmage, and he goes down right there. No gain on the play. What an advantage having a lead guy in the middle of the defensive line because not only does he take up the space and let the linebackers run free, but he can also make plays himself, as we just saw there. Over the middle, and it's incomplete. Trey Wayne's the Michigan State man right there in coverage. This is going to be the matchup to watch out on the perimeter, and it won't be the last time these two go at it. Both of them believe they are the superior. In this case, the win goes to the defense. On third down, he'll drop to throw, and that will be incomplete. And that's exactly what defenses talk about. You've got to find ways to get off the field when you can, especially on third down. And third down defense going to be vital in this game. Able to knock that one away. Don't chance it. Down. Man. So still a scoreless game in the first, but they're going to go for this thing on their own side of the field on fourth down. And able to catch it, but he's out of I said don't chance it, man. What the fuck's wrong with you? That's going to be a turnover on downs. I don't know why you would do that. It's almost guaranteed points the other way. I mean, I get it if it's a late game situation. Yeah. Maybe even fourth and inches. Basically, boy, yeah. It's a huge risk to take. Yeah, it's guaranteed points. But, yeah, you know, people way. want to chance stuff. Opening minute and already a trip to the red zone. They have a first and ten at the 18. And able to get him down, but he does reach the five. A solid pickup of 13 sets him up first and goal. At the five-yard line. They'll try and run for it on first and goal. And across the chalk, into the end zone, it's a 49er touchdown. A five-yard touchdown run. And the Niners have taken the early lead. That almost looked too easy, and I think thanks goes to the offensive line for making it look easy. Yeah, I agree with you totally on that one. I'm not sure how much everyone understands the preparations that go into a game for an offensive line because there's a reason that running Fuck backs me. and quarterbacks give them big gifts. I might need to start going for two now. A big year. <laughs> The consistency and the continuity it takes to know each other and execute their blocks is pretty impressive. Fair catch made at the I need to scoot it over. The Seahawks take over first and 10 at their own 25-yard line. Here's the Seattle offense ready to get this drive underway. And last time they were very fortunate this offense. They went for it on four, turned it over in their own territory. But the other guys held up. They didn't give up any points. So how about the guy with the number one headset on the sidelines, the head coach? That was planned going into it. Not necessarily to not get the first down or to, to have the defense have to hold But he up. trusted his defense. Trusted his defense very much. And I think that that's how he's going to play this game. Go for it. Be aggressive because I've got the wild bunch backing me up over here on my own side. Well, now we'll see what his offense can do. He'll try again with the arm here on second down. 
And that is incomplete. A lot of force bearing down on him there. He could not hang on. It's third down. Another incompletion there. That's five in a row now to start this game. He's got to take a deep breath now, step back, shake it off a little bit, trust his offensive line, and hope that his play caller dials up something that can give him a completion and get him going. Out of the gun now on third down. And that is incomplete. Every offense tells you they want to come out and start fast. That's not unusual at all. But this group, they've yet to get much. Yo, boy, Chris. Hey, like to you need to the kick the ball. ball. After this one. Bro. Or it's going to be points again. Call timeout or whatever. They don't care. That hasn't just about five They're yards back anyways. He didn't even try to signal for a timeout, so they must have not been aware of the numbers. I think he lost track of the time left in the play clock and probably was trying. Ooh, he fucking sucks. He fucking sucks, and he knows it. That marks me down for five now. Let's get that up. Look at this. Three more wins. Three more wins. We're going to Super Bowl. So we actually need a trial on this. Nothing you labeled impatient, but once the boss made it, you labeled amazing. Meticulous with words, such a force of nature. Boss. I don't want to seem absurd, but that boy's a gangster. Fo focusing on me, way from Tel Aviv. Barbados with the hustle, pockets, LRDs. Kick it off. Yo, kick the ball. Bunker ready to get this one started. And here we go. We're underway in Madden Ultimate Team. Oh, a good looking return set up here. The Niners take over first and 10 at their own 39 yard line. So from the 39 now, they'll come up on a first and 10. Nowhere to go that time. He maybe got a yard up to the 40. The tackle made by a Not much on that run, Charles. No, that's exactly the way to execute a run blitz there. They guessed correctly that they would move the ball on the ground, honed in on it, and stopped him. Marked that down for a win in the defense's column. Now left side, a completion to his tight end. And out of bounds on the other side of midfield at the 45. 
first and Love the play call that time. Love the design. You put three tight ends on the field. That screams jumbo set, running formation to a defense, right? No, they go play action, and defense gets confused for just a split second. And next thing you know, completion for good yardage. Linebacker Patrick Queen bringing him down. We've caught a lot of games, but we don't normally talk about inside linebacker being that fleet of foot, do we? No, yeah, he was able to get outside there to make that play. Yeah, and you know what makes them faster? Their ability to read plays, understand what offenses are trying to do, and put themselves in proper position. Rolling to his right. He'll run it. That's caught inside the Shit. 20. And he's going to be taken down here with a penalty flag on the field. That's a good chunk of yardage. It's going to be canceled out. And we always talk about hidden yardage in a game. That's going to count as that because now it doesn't go on the books. But now they have to make that up again, don't they? On the run, he'll let this go deep right side. And That's bullshit. To connect, incomplete. Now give them credit. They took their shot, but it's going to bring up fourth down. As soon as I saw him break contain and get outside, my first thought and my eyes gravitated downfield because nowadays, most of these quarterbacks, when they do that, they want the big play downfield. They don't want to throw it short. In this case, he took it. And he can't find a receiver, and he's brought down. The Niners go for it, but it doesn't work out. And this crowd into it early. Their guys stand tall okay. on the opening drive it's of the okay. football it's game. Okay. Jackson on first down, buying time to his left. Now he'll pull it down. And he's got room. And he takes this just a few yards shy of the red zone before going out. Able to make something out of nothing there. 17 yards and a first down. First and 10 at the 24-yard line. Dude's gonna take forever. Slow. He's slow. Oh, yeah. Now with a play clock at four, we're gonna get a timeout. You slow, bro. You slow. Remaining as we step aside here in this first quarter. Throwing now, Jackson on first down. He'll try and run it. And he gets it inside the 10 to the 9. A nice job there on the escape and scramble. A first down, a 16-yard gain. Man, defensively, that hurts. They got him out of his rhythm. They had him hemmed in. But somehow he was able to tuck it away and get away for a gain. They'll try and run for it with Henry. And they go the wrong way on this one. Losing yardage back at the 12. Guess who? J.J. Watt, as he so often does, getting in there to wreak havoc. They'll try again on second and goal after going backwards to the 12. Dancing to his left. And he can't find anywhere to go with it. And We're going to blitz, down. boy. We're going to blitz. Want to run? Run him down for a loss of 12 that time. Uh, definitely be a disappointment to come out of this starting run position with just three blitz. points. They need to try to dial something up now, third and 10. Escaping the pressure right. Fourth down now as San Fran's defense was strong in coverage. I know he was trying to get the completion downfield, but the way this game has gone, with a few of the runs he's made along the way, he should have kept the ball and taken it with his feet downfield. That's the big play that shreds the defense. Instead, he thought to himself, I'm a quarterback, I've got to throw it. He bailed out the defense with that incompletion. Harrison so a good kick there. They put the bow tie on it with three points. Don't worry about that and kick. Let's face it, everybody wants a touchdown. We know that. But in the NFL, defense kick that is shit off, good. You're not bitch. Score each and every time. Kick it off. Be able to knock the ball through the post and take the three. By the way, I said bow tie. I meant just bow. Kick the ball off, you punk. Yeah. Either way, you got I just went right past it. Come on. After the field goal, talk, here's talk. Butker to kick it away. Get your finger out of your ass. He was solid on the field goal, but not as solid on the kickoff there. And that'll put him at the 40-yard line to start this drive. This pussy wants to run with the ball, so, like, I ain't worried. 
So good starting field position for him here as they come up first and 10 at the 41-yard line. And oh, look at that, a diving catch. Good. Four. That's a good way to start the drive, 17 yards and a first down. When you're a player of his stature, you don't just circle the games on your team's calendar. You circle the Pro Bowl? <laughs> Without a doubt. That's a game that you just figure you're going to be in each and every year. And it's because of catches like that. That's why he goes. They'll run on first down. It's George. And they'll wind up getting this one all the way down inside the 20. 26 big yards on that one. It's another first down. We often poke a little fun at running backs past the age of 30. Oh, they're getting old. They can't run anymore. What he's showing past the age of 30, you can still have some nice runs like that. You certainly can. And I think that we're starting to expand our definition of old running back. Because it used to be as soon as they hit 30, we want to get rid of these guys and go to the younger guys. But now that the guys are taking such great care of themselves, as you pointed out, you can still get explosive runs at any age. 49ers with their first trip to the red zone thus far. They've got a first and 10 at the 17. They'll try the left side. George. And he'll be taken down at the two-yard line. Back-to-back -back nice gains. That one for 14 yards and another first. Would you say this offense is locked in right now? They're having no trouble on this drive. What, is it three plays? Three first downs. Yeah, you talk about on the march. They keep this up, they'll get to that end zone real fast. Looks like a jumbo set with three tight ends here for first and goal. Looking to throw. And it's complete in the end zone. Touchdown 49ers. A two-yard touchdown grab. And the 49ers have now taken the lead. There was a lot of zip on that pass, and baseball might have called that a frozen rope. I like it when you bring the diamond into the game. I'm going back to the grid. <sighs> it had some heat on that bad boy. Sometimes you throw a touchdown pass, and sometimes you throw, what, a touchdown strike? There you go. That's my that is so concert. relaxing. Myers connects you got to worry PNC. about his little three points that he's got on the board. Now, all he has to do is make mistakes, and I got this game right where I want it. I'm making him quit. This carries into the end all zone. you got to do is make mistakes, and we'll I win the game by you forfeiting. That's all. So, I really ain't worried about it. Because eventually you're going to make mistakes with that quarterback you got by running. And you're going to lose the ball. I'm going to take it. I'm going to make a touchdown. And that's how it's going to end. Or you're going to run out of time. And I'm going to win either way. Now problems right out of the gate. We're going to get a delay. And that will set them back five. Damn, it takes you forever to come up with a play, for real. Play clock down to zero, and this is not the way you to start lost a drive. 20 yards again. So that'll back him up five. Yeah, you lost 20 yards right there. Almost. That's half. That's a half of twenty yards. About to lose again. I 
make that 15 yards. Ah, ha, ha, ha. He was kicked, like I said. I guess he ran out of ideas. Let's see what we got here. See, I got these players. I don't have him. I have these two right here. Nicholas Monroe. Let me feel myself a little bit. Little bit, little bit. You ain't talking big. Get out my way, little bit. What's the lay that where you find me though? Cha cha macho with a rockin' black clothes. Whip around that Batmobile, duckin' 5 0. If you step to me, then be prepared for smoke, little bro. Uh, let me feel myself a little bit. Uh, let me blow this down a little bit. Drip. Little bit, little bit. Uh, let me feel myself a little bit. Little bit, little bit, you ain't talking big. Get out my way, little bit. Let me explain what I did. Can I kick it? Hold on. Yeah, I got some rings and a range. Can I kick it? Yeah. Don't ask me a thing. How I got her, how I did it. Yeah. Spend the whole half, had a blast. Can I kick it? Yeah. Even with a sprain. Can I kick it? Just the flex, I went and bought a chain. Can I kick it? Things ain't been the same. Things have changed. Can I kick it? People acting different, so I ask, can I? Hey, could count on my power and look at my dogs. So it was way back then, could claim what you saw, but you weren't with us. Hey. The higher the climb, the harder the fire, but how did you get up? I done got rich and went broke, then got rich again, just a little hiccup. I did be balling this pickup. Remember me being so bummy and being so hungry, I had to eat grocery. Hey. Let's see what I need. Yeah, 
That's 17,000. Right. Uh, that's 17,000. Right. So. A dub, I'm a win, I won't lose with this. I yeah, I'm a echo fool with this. I yeah, I'm a echo fool with this. I yeah, I'm a echo fool with this. I uh, turn the knob, can't resist, I'm incredible. I'm incredible. Yeah, I can't put a dollar, call it vegetable. Uh, can I get the dash? Can I catch me bro? Oh, can I get the dash? Can I catch me bro? Uh, your whole team is no competition. Boy, I did it by myself, it's a solo mission. I'm a fool, dog. Turn the whole field to a schoolyard. Bunch of students ain't eating around here. I'm the goat, little man, and I made it loud and clear. Put the gas on them like I'm with the Cavalier. Um, show no love, got the confidence, no fear. I use a dub, I'm a win, I won't lose with this. Ay, yeah, I'm an echo fool with this. Ay, yeah, I'm an echo fool with this. 
been ready for this. Since like 9-5, I've been eager for this. Talent on the rise, I'm consistent with this. Trophy is the prize, ain't no gimmicks with this. Okay, now what's left on them? Told you I'ma flex on them. I did it all subtle, ooh, and then I hit that exit on them. Gotta blame my faith, cause these eyes ain't got nothing on them. I secured the safe for the cradle, I ain't dropping nothing. Uh, only winning is exception, ain't no truce. Uh, ain't no truce. Ain't no I got him. Four MVP player. Alrighty. So we're gonna go back to China. back to playing. So that shit was great, my guys. Great. So we got one more season. One more. And then we're off to the Super Bowl. I don't know what you get for winning the Super Bowl, but Actually, yeah, two more. My bad. Five more. Five more, my gosh. Ready? Let's go. Let's go, bro. All right, give me a second before we start.
Not bad. I don't know what the fuck's going on with my shit. Let's go to YouTube. I'm streaming from YouTube, too, so... What the fuck, dude? Play. All right, guys. Yeah, play with accuracy now.
God. Of course he does. One minute. Might bring a different guy in. Yeah, a little bit. You mean a guy that slow can outrun you guys? What the fuck?
Got one more after this, and then Super Bowl time. But, yeah. <laughs> Can't count them out yet because this guy's not bad. I'm telling you, dude. Can I give you some advice? You throw a ball that deep with the dudes I got right now. That's what's going to happen to you. I'm not joking because I got some I got some pretty badass people out there. And some of them are just rookies now. Not bad. This dude's gone. He's gone.
He's going to burn his time out. This is really going to burn his time out. Takes it to Bryant. And he is going to have a Seahawks first down. And he's going to have it by plenty. Able to get eight yards there on third and two. And you see the clock almost empty, so this is likely the last play in the second quarter. The final shot here before half for Carr. Going deep here for Bryant. And for the third time here in this half, it's intercepted. Picked off by Sidney Jones. First half in the books. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. And we welcome you back live now inside the booth alongside Charles Davis. I'm Brandon Gunn, set and ready to rock for the third quarter. The Seahawks trailing, but they will have possession first here as we resume action in the third quarter. Fields it in the middle of the end zone. And no fireworks to start the half. This will be a touchback. to the line here to begin their next drive the Seahawks offense we have not seen much on offense here from either side these last few drives we've hit a wall so to speak and hit it hard out of it because the defenses right now they seem to be a step ahead don't they beating them to the point of attack beating them to the punch these offensive guys are tinkering like crazy and his pass is intercepted for the fourth time today picked off at the 46 Tough one there. First drive of the third quarter, throwing an interception, and now a chance that they could be in even a bigger hole if they can convert this into points. Yeah, but how good do you feel if you're that defensive coordinator right now? Because you just know that the head coach looked at him and said, turn him loose, big man. And he'd be able to take a few extra chances playing with this type of a lead, and boy, it paid off. He's going to try to get him to that guy again, so I, I ran him over there. It's a room to maneuver. And he gets this one inside the 15, just a yard or two shy of the 10. That one 28 yards on the ground. Now a first and 10 at the 11. They'll run with Jackson. And maybe a measure of revenge there. He's had his way in this one, but this time they get him behind the line. He'll lose a yard there, and it's second and 11. And plays like that are exactly what this defense needs here early in the second half to give it a little spark. I think their halftime adjustments, what they talked about, maybe it's just a little inspirational speech. Who knows? But looks like they're ready to go. Oh, did he hang on to it? He did on the dive. Nice grab. From six yards is the pickup, and that'll lead to a third down. I felt that one all the way up here. How about that big man laying out and making that catch? Yeah, that wasn't a 180-pound wideout. That was a tight end. Oh, it sure was. Down, this is Jackson, and they'll be driven back here, losing yardage to the nine. He was taken fourth down now after a loss of two. And that's what this defense is going to need to do more in the second half. Good pressure that time, forces some indecision in the backfield. He's going to wind up being taken down for a nice loss. Myers' kick is good, and the lead now 11, 24 to 13. So he missed that field goal earlier, but he says not this time. Able to knock it through, give his guys three. I like his poise. I like his confidence, his belief in himself. Sometimes when you miss that first one, you see a lot of guys sag and they can't make the next one. Not in this case. Stepped right up like a pro. Coming to the line here to begin their next drive, the Seahawks offense. They're sort of seeing themselves spiral out of control. Let's see if they can get things back on track. And this is where the coach is walking that line of being calm and really being firm with his team. Had one tell me once, you know, when we're having a tough patch, this too shall pass, this too shall pass. And it finally kept having a rough patch. He said, but you got to do something <laughs> up. to make it pass. And that's what they have to do. They've got to get some control back, get themselves reasserted, 
and calm things down. See if they can get calm and reassert themselves here. Back to the air on second down. It's Carr. Forced out to his left. That is caught left side by Bryant. And they work this well upfield across the 45. A gain there of 21 yards. Shotgun now for Carr. Oh, going for Jefferson downfield. And this will be incomplete. Physical play on the football there, and it's second down. I know he wants to get his team back in the game, but a 50-50 ball right there that maybe was a little questionable. Yeah, he's pretty lucky to get that one back. I think that sometimes his quarterbacks play with a lot of confidence that borders on arrogance, and that can put your team in some dutch. Yeah, especially maybe want to look at some safer routes after the interception he had that ended their last drive. He was trying to find Justin Jefferson there. And it's third down. Again, they'll throw with Carr. And a throw there going to be incomplete. Another throw there off the mark, and obviously he's battled. I think it was acceptable. She like got me. Hey, boy, be so you gotta yeah. go berserk. Okay. Mm. Sometimes you need a friend. Not the ones that just show up and don't put nothing in. You know the ones that lend their hand and want to see you win. When you come up on that lick, make sure you cut them in. And then, uh, sometimes you need a foe. Want to keep your eyes open, keep you on your toes. You know the ones that want to keep you where you've been before. But I can't go. No, I can't go. No, I can't go. And whoa, uh, sometimes I need a check. Not the sneakers, but the ones that make you watch your step. I sat down with my accountant, he said, I got good news and I got bad news. Okay. I said, what's the good news? He said, the good news is you made a lot. I okay. said, what's the bad news? The bad news is you spent more. Okay. All right. Sometimes you need the faith. Sometimes you need to know you worth. Sometimes you need to wait. Shoot like the golden boy, but in front of bay. You can't negotiate with Drake. You gon' have to pay for wait. Jugging on the main stage. The main frame. Loosen up your face, baby. Sometimes I need a vacay, meditate, hydrate, protect my energy uh, before engagement. Grew up having nothing, you're labeled impatient. Huh. But once the boss made it, you're labeled amazing. Meticulous with words, cause you force of nature. Boss. I don't wanna seem absurd, but that boy's a gangster. Fo focusing on me, way from Tel Aviv. Barbados with the hustle pockets, LRDs. Distinctive destinations, all I wanna see. Ocean from residence is three different ones a week. Cause I deserve that. It's time to learn that. Mess around and put that thing up where you're permanent. Six figures every year, yeah, I earn that. At the front of this line is where my turn at. to get us started and off we go in Madden Ultimate Team. him a yard to the 26. Absolutely love the effort there. The ability to flow from his inside spot and stop that one at the line of scrimmage. Nice linebacker play. 
Here's second and nine, just a yard on that last run. And a double coverage, and it's intercepted. Picked off at the 36. And the return here will go to the 31-yard line. That's kind of a double whammy. I mean, the interception on the opening drive, that's one thing. But to give them this field position, that's another. Absolutely perfect start for this defense. They take the ball away on the opening possession. They know that their offense will get the ball to start the second half. They line them up in field goal position. And to me, they got a chance for a touchdown right here out of the gate. That goes as a gain of 11 and a Patriot first down. Yard line. They fake the give. Now Mahomes. He'll buy some time. And he's going to have to eat this one as down he goes. Kerry Hyder flying in and laying the lumber defensively. Well, they go play fake. The problem is nobody was faked out. <laughs> and when no one's faked out, what's the end result? Sad. Quarterback gets hit. <laughs> And the job becomes twice as difficult now after the sack. It's second and 20. Here we go with Jamal Charles. And all the way in. Touchdown. New England. Jamal Charles. 30 yards. And the Pats have taken the early lead. People always talk about one of his biggest strengths, running the football vision, and he found the spot there, went into the end zone. You're exactly right about that. It wasn't just the vision, right? Once he saw the gap, decisiveness, made up his mind about the power to finish the play. Not only did he get good blocking, he created his own space as well. Benatari connecting on the extra point, and that makes the score 7-0. Terry now to kick it away after the touchdown. Fair catch made at the 25-yard line. The Niners take over first and 10 at their own 25-yard line. The 49er offense set to get this drive underway. They had the interception last time. It led to the opening touchdown. So now 7-0 the score as they start first and 10. And he finds a man on the crossing route. And he gets this one just shy of the 40 down at the 39. First play of the drive going for 14 and also going for a first down. Now back to throw. They'll roll him out right. Throw it across his body. That's bullshit, dude. Picked up by nine-time pro bowler Ed Reed. And he takes this one back into the end zone. To the Patriots. All right, this is bullshit. The Patriots. And this defense looking like they have come to play the pick six. And just like that, it's 13 nothing early on. Well, go back with me to our training camp visit. What do we hear during these drills? Pass. Pass. Ball. Ball's in the air. And then my favorite. Oski. That's the interception. That means everybody finds someone to block. Block them legally. Stay on your feet. And they get it done. Touchdown. Catch made at the 25 yard line. The Niners take over first and 10 at their own 25 yard line. The 49er offense set to get this drive underway. And job one here, Charles, just keep possession of the football. Two drives, two turnovers to this point. You're exactly right, Doctor. Hippocratic oath. First, do no harm. But right now, they're harming themselves on offense. I like that. No one is mistaking me for a doctor, though. But thank you, Dr. Davis. At the 24 yard line. After the loss to start out, here's second and 11. They'll set up to throw. And he goes down. It's a Patriot sack. Montez Fucking. Sweat showing his strength and quickness there. A loss of four. Now Charles dealing with a third and long. They'll have to try to go back to the air again. And this time avoid the sack. Certainly hard to try to establish momentum. But all you're doing is going backwards. Now protecting the passer. And he gets dumped on his backside. Under pressure again. And down he goes again. Montez Sweat picks up his second sack of the afternoon. Yeah, fuck this.
I thought I would do it, but nah. All I need is one more, that's it. I can't play person like that though. It's gotta be the right person. Set to go now on a beautiful sunny afternoon. And off we go from Seattle. From the six. And up to about the 26 yard line. We're going to play that. Huh? We're going to play like that, huh? Hello. Okay. All right. And he's taken down, but able to slip across the 35. What? Starting with a first down, 11 yards on that pickup. Well, there's plenty of real estate for him to maneuver on that run. And let's face it, it shouldn't be a surprise. He's one of the better backs in the league. No. Had to come into this game with the idea. Slow him down, otherwise it's going Subway, to be Subway, maybe. Afternoon. That's about it. Yeah. They look to throw now on first down. Pressure comes. He's oh. taken down by the Seahawks defense. Okay. Great job defensively. Yep. I think he was trying to go through his progressions, find someone to get rid of the football okay. before he knew it. He was on his back. So that just brings us right back to what you said in the beginning. A great job defensively. Nowhere Love to you too. Pressure too great. And uh, he goes down once more. The number one pick, Miles Garrett, coming in to drop him. Well, this is what happens when you get behind the chains, as people like to say, when you have obvious passing situations, hard to vary it up and fool the defense. And you hate those situations if you're an O-lineman, right? Oh, without a doubt, because you just know they're coming, and you never know exactly how. They can be exotic in their blitzes, or their athletic ability just takes over. And their opening drive here is going to result in a punt. They got seven yards there, but not enough. And it appears they'll go for it here on fourth down. A big call on the game's opening drive. They're indeed going for it as they look to throw. On the move to his left. And he'll lay out and pull it in. What a diving catch there. So not only do they convert on fourth, but they pick up 22 yards in the process. So from Seahawk territory now, it's first and 10 at the 49-yard line. They'll try the left side. George trying to get out wide, but he's going to be tackled right near the line of scrimmage. Taylor officially no gain on the play, and it's second down. Yeah, second down on the Seahawks' 49-yard line. So after the run for no gain, here's second and ten. Flushed out right. And this is going to be intercepted. Picked up by the six-time Pro Bowler, Eric Allen. And the return stops at the 39-yard line. Time will tell if that's an interception that rattles the rookie here. First drive on the road. And you know the discussion going into the game? Centered on, okay, let's get out nice and easy. Take care of the football. We're on the road. You're a youngster. Let's not make mistakes early. But now the conversation will shift to, okay, put it behind you, move on. Long way to go in this one. And incomplete as he was knocked as he threw it. And it took the ball off course. So line of scrimmage. Still dude's going to hate this. He's going to hate it. So I'm going to do the same thing he's on me. And a 
able to get a couple as he's across the 40 to the 41. They do get a couple, but they'll be left staring at a third and eight coming up. On third down, Griffin. Yeah, that one's going to be knocked away and incomplete. So it doesn't look like they're going to be able to build off the turnover. Well, the defense certainly did its part to got them the football. But you're exactly right. It looks like they're going to have to punt this one away. And it's not a turnover, but doesn't it feel like one after grabbing the momentum with the defensive play? Yeah, and they had all that momentum after getting the football, and now zapped right back in the other direction. Boy, a curious decision to go for it. Doesn't pan out, and that will force a turnover on downs. They'll run on first down. It's George. And brought down, but not before they're inside the 25. That good for 19 at a first down. That's his longest run of the first quarter. And, Charles, we talked before the game about them needing to establish the run game. They'll be looking for more of that. And they got to the perimeter. So that tells me that that's part of the game plan of what they want to get done today. So they'll have some complimentary runs where he'll run it to the inside. But it appears that when they want the big yardage, they think they can get to the outside and make it happen. Brings up second and 11 at the Seahawks' 23-yard line. Second and 11. Firing quickly here, and that's complete. The reception good for seven. It's third down. Got a big window to throw. Coverage wasn't too bad there. Yeah, they had him under wraps pretty well, but somehow able to muscle his way open and catch the ball. And this is going to be intercepted. It's the former Patriot, Devin McCourty. That pick hurts a little extra because it was third down. You were already in field goal range. You know what he's going to hear all night, all next week? Situational football. Understand what's going on because you expressed it perfectly. Three points. In. And the Niners get there and bring him down. He was trying to keep his eyes downfield. Nobody came open. He was trying to do everything that he had been taught, right? Every bit of the technique. But if no one's open, there is no technique except make sure you hold on to the ball as you go to the ground when you're getting sacked. Steps away to his left. Complete. Jefferson the target. And it's a big play there as he is finally taken down on what will be a terrific final act of this first quarter. No score after one on EA Sports. No score. So that's about as long a non-scoring play as you're going to see from inside their own 10 to first and goal. They'll try and run. This is Williams. And he'll be stopped about a yard shy of the goal line after a pickup of about three. Short of the goal. They went to a nickel defense, and that's a surprise this close to the goal line because ordinarily you use... The back end of the end zone, the sidelines is extra. And he is in for the Seattle touchdown. Taking it in from a yard out as his guys are first out of the scoreboard here this afternoon. Well, we had the scoreless first quarter of play. We sure didn't have to wait long into the second quarter to get some action on the scoreboard. So was the first quarter a feeling out process? I mean, that was an interesting quarter, wasn't it? Because we had some action. We had some good play. Just didn't have any points. So now it's game on. Set now to kick this one away, and off it goes. Taking it about the one. And able to get this out to the 25. First and 10 at their own 25-yard line. The 49er offense set to get this drive underway. To this point, the results have not been good. Two possessions, two turnovers. And that's pressure from his right, and he goes down hard, flat on his back. Miles Garrett able to get in there for his second sack of the afternoon. Sacks a growing theme in this first half. This is second and long. And this one taken in on the right sideline, but not in the field of play. They say it's incomplete. The throw led him a little too far. It brings up third down. On play.
Play action. They'll throw. Now the pressure comes, and he goes down. Just inside the 10, back at the 9. We've watched this a long time, and I still don't believe we get it. Third and long, why are you calling play action? Because yeah, they're not going to bite defensively, right? No, not at all. I did have a coach explain to me years ago that for some teams, that's how they have to deal with pass protection and their line blocking. But to me, it seems silly. Yeah, well, they're silly, and that leads to a play action sack. Yeah, fuck this. He's got overall 99 players. There's no beating him. I'm 100% I'm sure there's no beating him. I mean, I've played, I've played good players, but that isn't, yeah. I don't want to get rid of my players that I got. That's one a rookie. Mind me, but shit. I like that. I'm sorry that I forfeited the game. Uh, there's no way in hell I can play a rookie player against a 99 overall player especially if their team's probably got nothing but 99 overall players that's huh. that would be a big no no very big no no cuz trust me you can uh You can play a player like that. <clears throat> but when... But when it comes down to it... When it really comes down to it... What happens when you do play a player like that? This is the problem right here. It's gonna want me to get rid of all my good players. No, and I can't. 
and spin the block around just like the hands on the clock. Just like the hands on the clock, I go back to bat when I'm doing numbers. All the mad that I'm dropping the bus, so they threw me under. Heard they mad they don't want to bust, so they boo each other. Think that they're the winning team, go losing, then they choose another. And that's okay, cause I'm competing with me, not you. I live with blessings like I can't stop sneezing, not you. I hate to break up with me and myself, top two. I blow away the competition like a ball of hot soup. And there's no catch. I go and get the bag and I'm not bringing it back. I'm like a down QP. I put the pain in the past. And if you ever had a problem, promise I didn't ask. So it's 444 in the car of a dash. I'll shake a pick, told them all you went first, you last. Little boy, that's facts. I'm gonna throw that cash to my money. <laughs>
How the hell would that? <clears throat> All right, guys. Now, drop my controller. Try not to fuck my controller up. Start the shit.
I'll keep that on our Sorry if it fucks up, guys. Especially for you on Facebook. I'm streaming on my... F well, no, not Facebook. YouTube. For you on YouTube, I'm streaming on Facebook and Twitch. So, like, it's not... I'm not running, like, like one. I'm running all three of them. Facebook. So you can f actually find me on Twitch or Facebook. I know it's difficult, but... So like, when I go on here and stuff like that, I'm actually trying to make the stream a lot more comfortable for everybody to come in and stuff and actually you know learn who I am and learn what I can do and stuff so like it's it's a win for a win guys you can actually get to learn who I am and what games I play, you can learn from you can learn from my games and stuff like that too. So I like to, you know, teach other people how to do things that uh, some people don't know. I don't know what the fuck's going on here. Maybe I might need to start this again. I don't know. Let's try this again. There we go. This. Okay. Okay. 